Hello, my most amazing artists. Today we are gonna finish our weaving project. So when you get to your seat, your project should look like this. It should be folded and your paper strips should be in here. Remember, we numbered these paper strips last week for a reason and you may have woven some of your paper strips, but you'll need to be sure that they're woven correctly. So for instance, this one, I don't believe is woven correctly. So, because if you notice, these two beside each other are doing the same thing. These are both going over and then they're going under this. So we have to do opposite. So what I'm gonna do, let's see, let's make sure that this was strip number one. Let's just take these out and we're gonna reweave. So if you did yours correctly, you will not have to tape it, take any strips out. But I'm gonna show you how to reweave this. We're gonna take everything out. Whoop. And we are going to make sure that we have these in the correct order. There's strip number four. That's number six. There's three, five, six. So we're putting these in order. I'm gonna kind of put them off to the side. So we'll start with strip number one. So remember to weave, we're gonna go over, then under, then over, then under. This is an AB pattern. Over, under, over. Okay, and then we're gonna slide it to the end. All right, just like that. Now we need strip number two. All right, and this one started over. So this strip will need to start by going under because it needs to be opposite of the one next to it. So we're still gonna do the same thing. We're gonna go under, over, under, over, under, over, under, but it should be opposite of this strip. So if I look, that went over, this one's going under. It went under here, so it's gonna go over here. So look, under, over, under, over, under, over. And if you weave this correctly, your strips won't fall out. If your strips are falling out, it's likely that you did not weave correctly. So now if I look, these are opposite. So here's strip number three. This started under, so this one needs to start over. So we're gonna go over, under, over. Sometimes it's hard. Under, over, under, over. Okay, and I'm gonna push it. And I'm just gonna check myself and make sure that this is correct. So if I look, over, under, over, under, over, under over, under, over. So if it's opposite, it's correct. So now let's go to strip number four. This started by going over. This one's gonna start by going under. And as I start putting them in, I do like to kind of bring my strip over here because it's hard to weave it right next to the other one. But just once you know how to start it, starting this one is gonna go under, then over. So I just know under, over, under, over, under, over. So under, over, under, over, under, over. And then I'm gonna slide it. Once I get it in there, I'm gonna slide it down. And I'm gonna keep doing that until I don't have any more space over here. Remember, your strips go in order. So there's six, here's seven, here's eight, but I am on strip number five. This simple, you're always going over, under, over, under, over, under. You just need to figure out which way to start. You alternate the beginning of each strip. Okay, when you have all that you can fit in there, you might have to make sure that you can't push your strips over a little bit because if I look here, I can push these strips over. Sometimes they get caught and it doesn't seem like they'll push over. But you just have to figure out where they're getting caught so that you can push them over and have them be tight. So once I do this, I'll actually be able to add more strips in here. And if you do this correctly, and you weave it correctly, then your strips will stay tight in here. So like when I lift this up, they're not falling out. If your strips are falling out, then you haven't woven this correctly. So I feel like I could get at least one more strip in here. This looks weird up here because this strip is not long enough. It must've got a piece cut off of it um, because it didn't go all the way. So that's okay, if that happens to you, that's it's not a big deal. But I'm gonna try to weave one more strip in here and then I think I'll be done. So this was eight, here's nine. I have to start by going over because this one went under, so over, and then I start my pattern. Over, under, over, under. And as you get to the end here, use your finger to push up from behind to pop those up to make them go under, and that will help you. And then, I don't know, I might could fit one more strip, but we shall see. It depends on if this number 10 strip is very big or not. No, nope, not very big, so I think I might can fit it. Not quite sure which way it goes. Okay. 
Okay, I think that's all I can fit. When you're done, bring me your project and I'll see if I can help you scoot things down so that you can add in more strips. But this is all you're doing today. I hope you get finished weaving. Have fun.